Assalamu alaikum. My name is Kuratulain Qureshi. My roll number is BP1650174. The topic for my presentation is a drug called etoposide. Etoposide is an anti-cancer, anti-neoplastic agent. It is basically used to manage and treat various type of cancers such as soft tissue cancers. By classification, it is topoisomerase 2 inhibitor. It is semi-synthetic analog of pudophilotoxin. It works by slowing or stopping the growth of cancer cells in the body. Different brands are available for the drug such as etosid, etoposid, etopol, and oncosid. Available dosage forms are capsule, injectable, and lipophilized powder for injection. Doses, capsules and injections are available in 50 mg, while powder for injection is available in 100 mg strength. Indication, this drug is used as a most active chemotherapeutic drug for refractory pediatric neoplasms, hepatocellular carcinomas, acute non-lymphatic leukemias, prostatic and ovarian carcinomas, and non-small cell lung carcinomas. Etoposides inhibit DNA synthesis by forming a complex with topoisomerase 2 and DNA. This complex breaks the double strain of DNA and prevents the repairing by topoisomerase binding. So it further prevents the entry into the mitotic phase of cell division and lead to the cell death. In this mechanism, this slow down or stop the growth of cancer cells in the body. Side effect, as we said that it is the most active chemotherapeutic agent, so it has some common side effects. So it includes hair loss, anemia, nausea, severe vomiting, skin rashes, muscles, cramps, etc., etc. Adverse effect includes hypersensitivity, patient feels swelling, sweating, chills, and fever, tachycardia, abdominal cramps, peripheral neuropathy. If we talk about the interaction, this drug is interacted with certain classes of the drugs such as anticoagulant, antiplatelates agent, and cells especially aspirin may increase the risk of bleeding. Apart from these above classes, there are total 349 drugs to interact with the etoposide. Some of them are zoldronic acid, ondansetron, alparazolam, lorazepam, paclitaxel, and much more. Beside of the adverse effect and side effect, this drug exists some major toxicities. They are myeloseparation, mucositis, cardiomyopathy, and severe tissue damage. If we look upon the contraindication, this drug is contraindicated in severe bone marrow depression, severe hepatic or renal impairment, existing or recent viral infection, some acute or chronic bacterial infections, intraperitoneal or intrathecally administration of this drug is also contraindicated. The contraindicated in pregnancy, but safety during pregnancy category D, lactation or in children is also not established. This drug is irrationally used in Hodgkin and non-Hodgkin lymphomas, acute myelogenous, non-lymphocytic leukemias. Till, up till now, we have discussed some essential information regarding the drug. Now we have a case study of this drug. A very pleasant 67-year-old female with extensive stage of cell, small cell lung carcinoma. She has one treatment postponed due to the count. She has low blood count. She has left scapular pain status post satiscan of the thorax. Let's make a soap note on the case. 
subject, object, assessment, and plane. Subject. She has a sixty-seven year old. She her she is female. She she comes she comes with a chief complaint: extensive stage small cell lung carcinoma and left scapular pain. Medication. Currently, she is taking carboprotein and etoposide for her small cell lung cancer. Objective by monitoring, we get to know that she has a normal vitals such as she has BP of one one eight by sixty. Her heart rate is seventy six. She has ninety seven point eight temperature and regular cardiovascular rate. Assessment: extensive small cell lung cancer. Differential diagnosis tell us the left scapular pain. Plan. Treatment. We would suggest her to continue with her previous medication, that is carboplatin, ten mg per ml, and etoposide, hundred mg per meter square, in a regimen, and further prescribe her levothyroxine, eighty-eight mcg once in a day, and vicodin, five by five hundred mg, one to two tablet, q six hours, as she has a low blood count, so require platelet. transfusion that's all for my topic thank you